Now I'll help you understand gene therapy for hair loss. But before that, a brief disclaimer. Gene therapy for hair loss is not for pregnant ladies and for lactating mothers and for people under 18 years of age. It is not also recommended for people with severe infection or any severe disease. Before starting gene therapy for hair loss, consult with your family physician so that he can check your head and your hair to see if you have any severe infection there, severe dandruff or pimples etc. In which case you do not start with gene therapy for hair loss. If everything is normal, then we can start with gene therapy for hair loss. Now we come to gene therapy proper. It consists of six products and one derma roller. The derma roller is to be used for micro needling. So derma roller is a roller with needles and you press it and roll it on the part of your scalp where you have thin hair. Derma roller or if you want to use a derma pen or a derma stamp, all three are all right they should have a needle length of at least one millimeter and you have to press the derma roller properly into your skin and then roll it so that there is pinpoint bleeding pinpoint bleeding is compulsory for gene therapy to be effective once the derma roller has been used and you notice pinpoint bleeding all over then you spray resveratrol grapeseed serum Derma roller has to be applied only once a week. When you apply derma roller, you wash your head first. So ideally, you can do it on your weekly holiday. Wash your head so that you remove any dirt, any chemicals, any products from them. And then you use derma roller on wet scalp. It will move easily and it will not get entangled. Do not use it in a crisscross manner. Just follow the direction of hair while you are using the derma roller. Make sure that the needle penetrate all the way into the skin. This way the skin pores get opened up, fine channels are created so that your skin becomes super absorbent. So anything which is applied to that skin gets absorbed. So of course take care, do not apply any harmful things on your scalp for the next 24 to 48 hours. That means no hair color, no chemical based shampoos or cosmetics. Wait for at least 24 hours before you shampoo your head. If you want to wash your head before that, use do it with plain water. Now we come to the serums which you will be applying on your head. Apply the resveratrol grapeseed serum every night or every day at least once a day. Do not confused derma roller is to be used once a week but the resveratrol grapeseed serum is to be applied every night leave it overnight wash it off the next morning with water the next serum is fisetin liposomal lotion this you use twice a week you use it as a hair mask or as a hair oil apply it and rub it on your scalp skin do not waste it on your hair if you have long hair. It is only on the scalp skin that we need to apply fisetin so that it is absorbed into and reaches the vicinity of the stem cells. Then we have the supplements. Then we have Astragalus serum. Astragalus serum is in the booster pack. You can apply that also. So in the daytime, if you have to apply Astragalus as well as resveratrol, then first apply resveratrol, wait for one hour and apply astragalus on the same scalp without washing it. Third step is improving the epigenome. Epigenome means the quality of your blood because your stem cells are surrounded by your blood. So we need to provide all the supplements, the nutrients that are required for the stem cells to start healthy multiplication. We will also provide all the signaling molecules which are required by the stem cells to start multiplying once again. So the first supplement is biotin plus which contains biotin, beta cetosterol and green tea extract. Take at least two capsules every day either on early morning on empty stomach or you can take it one in the morning one on evening. The next one is omega-3 fish oil capsules. Take two of them either together once a day, every day or take them one in the morning, one in the evening, preferably on empty stomach. The next supplement is Glynec, a combination of glycine and N-acetylcysteine. 
both of these are individually very helpful for your hair growth but your liver can use both of them to make glutathione glutathione is the master antioxidant it protects your skin and hair and all parts of your body we are interested in hair so glutathione protects the stem cells of your hair follicles from oxidative stress that helps the stem cells start multiplying again resulting in better hair growth minoxidil tablets i do not advise minoxidil spray because it is very messy and has a lot of side effects because minoxidil is made in a spirit base but now we have minoxidil tablets so if your weight is above 50 kg start with 2.5 mg tablet one tablet every day with lunch make sure that you do not suffer from low blood pressure if you have low blood pressure do inform us and do not take minoxidil tablet otherwise if you have normal blood pressure or high bp also you can take minoxidil 2.5 mg once a day safely i recommend that you take minoxidil 2.5 mg at lunch with your lunch that is the safest and the best way minoxidil will push the blood towards your hair root so that all the supplements which we are giving you they will also be transported better and in larger quantities to the vicinity of the stem cells of your hair root where they are required so that those stem cells can start multiplying and once they multiply you will notice better and stronger hair so within 2 months most of my patient they notice drastically reduced hair fall some of them notice almost no hair fall and if you pull your hair like this the hair is strong it will not come out in your hands that is called the hair pull test and of course take regular pictures you will see improvement in the hair diameter also if you do see that my request is please send the progress pictures to me also gene therapy for hair loss also has some booster products for those who are interested one is stem cell booster it contains nmn that is nicotinamide mononucleotide which is a nad precursor nad means energy so nmn is required and it helps your stem cell by providing them energy in form of nad so that they can multiply rapidly resulting in better hair growth the other booster product is senolytic autophagy activator which contains fisetin and epigenin This is specially helpful if you are recovering from an illness. The other booster is Senolytic Autophagy Activator. It contains fisetin and epigenin. The role of both these uh, supplements is to remove dead cells and senescent cells from your body and also from the vicinity of stem cells of your hair follicle. Both of these uh, booster products are specially helpful if you are recovering from a weak state means if you have been under severe stress or you if you had some severe illness like covid or if it has been after childbirth or after menopause then these booster products will help you even more if you want to read the research about these booster products you can contact us we'll send you the url or the links or you can find it in the description of this video thank you